Hey, welcome back everyone to uh, another Let's Play for God of War. So, uh, we had upgraded our Leviathan Axe in the last part, and um, that actually had also unlocked some skills for us that we explored. Oh, I'm sorry, armor and everything that we explored. Uh, let's go in here real quick while we're in the menu. I had noticed, like, so there's an exclamation in here, and. Um, I just want to make sure what it's okay so it's just this one it just says I equipped it which is fine if I go to sockets for this uh, I don't think I have anything empty enchantment socket and maybe I can oh there we go so we can do the symbol of truth an enchantment that increases strength and runic by three defense by two cooldown is there any for vitality symbol of shadow symbol of truth let's do that so we're gonna up our stats a little bit more with the sockets which is always a good thing and let's go to the sockets for this I think we are okay but I just want to double check yeah these are taking my stats down so sigil of the axe is fine um, and let's go to skills so we're whoa what happened there I missed something Oh uh, shoot. I don't know if it was like some menu that popped up that I missed. I hope not. <laughs> this is the thing I don't like in games sometimes. Like I'll back out of menus or something and I'm like, okay, did I miss something or what? So if you guys know that I missed something, in the, let me know in the comments. But I don't think I did. Um, so what is what new stuff we got? Aim and hold R1 to select three targets on a single enemy or... A across three separate enemies what to select three targets oh, okay so like three targets on a single enemy or three separate enemies okay that's kind of a cool one previous skill required for this precision throw combo now creates a massive explosion on impact after landing a precision axe throw weak points and headshots press triangle during the flash to recall the leviathan axe and cause the next throw or melee attack to explode on contact inflicting frost damage okay What's the, uh, the new one? Increases the amount of permafrost gained on every successful exit. While evading, hold L and hold L back and press R1 for a quick boomerang throw. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I'm not too keen on that one. This one, though, this one's kind of cool. You can hit like three or up to three points on someone. That's kind of a neat one. Requires vitality, 13. Wait, what does that say? It requires vitality of 13 out of 200. Increase, oh, additional bonus. Okay, increases resistance to interruption during this attack. I see. Uh, let's get this. Okay. Hunter killer. Uh, previous bonuses required. You know, this is only, I mean, it's a thousand XP, but still, I mean, I'm kind of... I'm not too keen on the frost damage on this. I think I've already explored all of these before, so... Hold R2 for a brutal cleave attack that deals massive damage. This might be handy, though, <laughs> I don't mind saying. Because these enemies are getting Im impressively smarter and stronger. Hold R1 for an axe attack that, enemies, that hits enemies multiple times and locks them down. Hold R1. So much to remember in this game. Okay, this is also a cool one. Perform attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up the Leviathan Axe and inflict frost damage on every hit. Yeah, that is kind of a cool one, isn't it? Okay, so I think I'll probably get that. All right. So thanks for bearing with me there. I wanted you guys to see what I'm upgrading and stuff, and like I don't know, I don't like to skip that stuff in my let's play. So I hope you guys appreciate it. Okay, maybe now this will. Oh, this is the one with the three attacks. Can I do the three attacks? Which? How did you do the three attacks? I mean, I don't know if I can hit. 
Oh, how did you do the three attacks? Let's see. Uh, let's see. Hold, aim and hold R1 to select three targets on a single enemy. So maybe this is not an enemy, so it's not going to let me do it. That's what it is. Yeah, so I'm holding R1, but it's just... It's not letting me do it. I mean, that's really... Let me make sure I read it right. Uh, oh, it, oh, you see it actually maintained my position where I left last. Aim and hold R1. Okay. So... This... This, this. No, I don't think it's gonna do it. Okay, so let's start with the weaker one. Ah, oh, you gotta do it in one shot like this. Smart. Boat is free indeed. Okay, so with the boat free now, let's let me just make sure there is nothing back here. Atreus, here. Yes, father. Nothing. Nothing. Nice water. Waterfall, I should say. Any buckets, anything hanging in these areas? Maybe the buckets were only back there and not in Alfheim. I don't see any. Nope. you say? I said nothing. Really? Okay. That's troubling. Is he hearing something or some spirit or something or what? Did your mother speak of this realm? Not much. Just that since the elves are always fighting over the light, they kept them isolated. I'm just taking in the atmosphere. That almost looks like like someone's face, you know, with a little eye patch or something in the back. <laughs> wow, look at this. Beautiful. Okay. Sorry, I get distracted. Before we go there, let me turn around. I think that's like the main story part, I think. Yeah. So what's over here? I see some loot up there. Said nothing. Where? This one you said something. What is it, boy? I knew it. Voices. You don't hear that? I hear nothing. It's going away now. It was screaming. Lots of voices. Angry. You really didn't hear that? No. It felt. Evil. 
Man, I hope he's okay. I don't know how you pronounce that. I know the witch pronounced it and I forgot. Yggdrasils? Dew of cooldown? Epic. A drink from the dew of the world tree. Oh, from the world tree. A drink from the dew of the world tree brings lasting benefits. Cooldown permanently increased by two. Sweet. Looking back, make sure I don't miss anything. Okay. Look, should we try talking to them? No. But maybe they need help. They do not stop us, so they do not concern us. But they maybe... do not concern us. Kratos is focused, man. He's like, they do not concern us. I like how the fog clears up and everything, you know? But I do want to talk to them if I can. There's no interaction button. I wonder if you have to interact with these flowers everywhere you go. I wonder like a maybe like a trophy for it or something. I don't know. See these flowers? Like they disappear when you come close to them, I think. See? Oh, there's over there too. I bet you there's gotta be something for that. Here, let me do it. Let me do it. I like doing it though. <laughs> I know it sounds silly, but... Tight spot, Kratos. Can you do it? Can you do it, man? Can you do it? Yep. I just wanted to see one that they would disappear and they did. And like I said, I have a feeling, maybe not for the one up above, but at least the ones that are downstairs. You know, you gotta do some silly stuff in games. statue man wonder who that is that must be the ring temple the elves can't work things out. Now find such a beautiful place, but war makes it ugly. You see with the eyes of a child. In war, a soldier sees beauty only in the blood of his enemy. The rest of him is lost. Sometimes never to return. You know about war, don't you? Wars are fought for two things, survival or advantage. Battles may be won by the better soldier, 
Wars are won by those who are willing to sacrifice everything to ensure victory. Heavy wars, Kratos. He's lived it too, man. Kratos has definitely lived it, for sure. Can we dock here? Yeah, we can. Oh, look at the marble floor. I think it's marble. Look, they have sand bowls in Alfheim too. <laughs> it looked marble-ish. Maybe it was just water. Okay, let's Should see. What does it ask? Without me or within me, death is sure. Yet within you, I am life most pure. But I don't see any runes around here. Oh, we must find it. Back to the boat. I think you're right. The runes aren't here. Maybe we should head to the temple? Well, look at this detail. We I mean, look at the marble finish in the center, the blue. It's like the light's reflecting off of it just perfectly. Wow. Okay, let's do this. with the music I'm not going straight over there I mean I'm gonna like check what's around here first yeah see Sindri said mother was a warrior was she in a war too of a sort her family was decimated by hostile rivals and she alone survived she walked the warrior's path, but her war was to live on, to brave an unforgiving world alone. And that's why she has Sindri and Brock to make her the axe? She had the strength to wield such a weapon, and the wisdom to use it for good. She found purpose in protecting the weak. So, she'd help out the elves? No. Huh. Oh boy. You see that over there? How do you mark again? There we go. What level is he? Oh, dang. Okay, let's do this. Here we go. Not anymore, boy. Son of a bitch! How did he... We definitely used our frost skill right there. Hitting R2, I think it was. Let's see in the skill tree. Uh, performs attacks in quick succession. That one, sorry, not R2. Without sustaining damage to power of the Leviathan Axe and inflict frost damage. And then we'll try aim and hold R1 to select three targets. Okay, we still gotta try that. Alright. Oops, sorry. Too many places to go. I want to go over there first. There we go. B. 
Be ready! Above you, watch out! That didn't work. Son of a gun, I have... There we go. Okay. So that was kind of cool. It was marking those white spots, if you guys saw them. These nightmares can blind us for a little bit, just when I thought nightmares couldn't get any worse. Gloom nightmare. Okay. So that is kind of cool. You just gotta hold R1. Brought us up here for what? Ooh, look at this guy. Hidden. Yeah. It's interesting. See, it says killed 10 of 15, but on the outside it says 51. Raven God's eyes and ears are everywhere. See that? 10 of 51. But when I opened up the best diary, it said 15. So. What is that noise? It's like something's moving. Maybe it's this tree is like a creature? Okay. Hey, that could be valuable. In the endless wars between the light and dark elves, a lot of amazing relics have been abandoned. We should pick up any we find. Brock would pay good hack silver for these. Okay. Amazing relics have been abandoned, huh? Alright, good to know. Is there anything else back there? Ooh, there is. Look at that. No interaction, so... No ladder, nothing we can break down, can we? Is there something up there that I can interact with? No, I cannot. Worth a try. We'll have to come back. Hidden chambers. Find and enter all of the chambers when able. When able. That's an interesting s choice. Uh, so we probably don't have it. There are seven locked doors throughout the world. Find them all. Okay. I keep hitting the touchpad to come to the map. I shouldn't be doing that. I should just be hitting circle. We'll need something to get through this one. Okay. Okay. I'm just making sure I didn't... I thought there was something back there. I was turning around, so... Okay, now I can use my skill, maybe? Or can we do this one at a time? Yep. Maybe I can use my skill. I don't know. This doesn't work on this. I keep forgetting. we go so we're gonna have to line up these shots together to unlock this chest can we drop down okay so I'm gonna have to shoot this and climb over quick there we go
Now, let's see. Ooh, this is still a tough shot, though. Oh, maybe you shoot the last one and bring him back. Because it's the arch of the... When you hit triangle, it arches back. Watch. Oh, almost. Almost. There we go. Silver. And there's that spot up on the top that we saw from down below. <gasps> Frost Giant's Frenzy, heavy runic attack. Three powerful slam attacks that launch enemies and then sends them flying. Ooh. Frost Giants Frenzy. So hold L1 and R2. Right now it's the Frost Attack and then three powerful slam attacks. Ooh, I like that. You see the video? Three powerful slam attacks that launch enemies and then sends them flying. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Yes, give it to me. Because the one I have right now is uh, this one right here. That just freezes all enemies, but... Okay. We should upgrade this. How much? 3250. We can also upgrade the other one. I'm torn between which ones to upgrade, because I have to try them out first to see which ones I'm gravitating towards most during my gameplay sessions, and then I'll probably spend the XP on that. Um... Because my XP is limited. Hack Silver, I have enough, but my XP is kind of limit. X XP, excuse me, is kind of limited. So let's see how this one plays out. L1 and R2, right? Is what it said. L1 and R2, yeah. Sweet. Okay, so we got this. Whoa, what is that? Oh man, I don't want to like do this right now and then realize it goes into the water and I lose it. So I'm not going to do it from here. I had another like bucket like back in a previous part where I had something like that. So the bucket like dropped and then by the time I could reach it, it was gone. Okay. So I think this area we pretty much explored and we can continue to the next, you know, I would call it like a boat dock or something like that. But um, so I think this will be a good stopping point. So thank you for tuning in. Uh, and I will catch you in the next one.